Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel. And uh, on Windows 10, we talk about, you know, some of the features make it sometimes to Windows 10. It can happen. Sometimes an update, but not all of them. And especially when we talk about a new app, uh, chances are it's not going to come to Windows 10. So a couple of you have asked as a question, uh, is Copilot going to be a Windows 10 app also? Now, all indications show that Copilot is going to be Windows 11, 22H2, and forward only. And a lot of the focus is on, you know, Windows 11 AI future or artificial intelligence. But you know what? If you've watched my Windows 11 Copilot video, um, really, when we go to Microsoft Edge and you go to the uh, little Bing chat icon on the upper right honestly not much difference it's pretty much the same thing it's just not a standalone app but you can ask it to do whatever you want anyways so you know it's gonna work and it's fine here um, you know like create I could say create a picture of autumn so completing here leaves here we go so you know it's it works it works fine it works in the same way so I don't see the need honestly it works in there I don't see the need for a standalone app you know why have a standalone app to do this you got all the features here and it's gonna work fine now there's no microphone for the audio input but hey it's okay. I mean, look at that. It works fine, and you can ask it to do things like this. Works correctly. So, um, no standalone app. I don't think it will ever come to Windows 10. But you know what? You just open up and fire up Edge. Actually, you can fire up any browser because there's a um, add-on that also is available for uh, Google Chrome. So uh, that add-on to Google Chrome will add also the uh, Bing. Or, you know, you can call it Copilot. It's pretty much that. And in the form of a, a window within the browser. So, uh, you know, you got it anyway. You just got it in a different way and it's not a standalone app. That's all. Uh, and, you know, in Windows 11, it's pretty much Edge. I'm pretty sure it's simply a Edge customized to open as a panel. That's it. It's not really a standalone app per se, but much more a panel that is Microsoft Edge for the Copilot stuff. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe. Give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.